Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the 2020 virtual graduation celebration for the School of Engineering and Applied Science. Thank you for joining us. My name is John Locke, and I am the Dean of the School of Engineering and Applied Science. On behalf of my colleagues at the school, I am delighted to welcome all of you to the George Washington University School of Engineering and Applied Science graduation celebration during this 199th year of the university and the 100, 138th year of our school. GW's commencement ceremony will occur on Sunday morning when University President Thomas LeBlanc will invoke the authority granted to the university by the Congress of the United States to confer bachelor's, master's, and doctoral degrees upon our students. Today, we are celebrating the accomplishments recognized by these degrees and recognizing each graduate individually. To begin the ceremony, one of our own graduates will sing the national anthem. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the As the Dean of Seas, I am privileged to preside over this ceremony to celebrate the academic achievement of our new engineers and computer scientists. And I thank you again for setting aside this time to join our ceremony. I especially want to thank our graduating seniors whom we honor today. I thank you all for the ways you've contributed to the Seas community during your undergraduate years. I thank you for the unique gifts and talents you've shared with your classmates the mentoring you've freely given to underclassmen to help them along the way, the enthusiasm you've brought to your studies and class projects, and the bonds you've helped build that strengthen the SEAS community. All of us here at SEAS had hoped to be, with you in, to hope to be with you today in person to celebrate your achievements and meet your families and friends. We know that a virtual ceremony cannot replace the joy of introducing your family, friends, professors and mentors to each other, that it can't capture the excitement, buzz, and preparation of the day, and that it can't provide that proud moment you've looked forward to when you hear your name called and you walk across the stage in the Smith Center to receive your well-deserved recognition. Speaking on behalf of the C's faculty and staff, I can tell you that we're disappointed too. We've worked with you throughout your undergraduate journey and watched you learn and grow and we take pride in seeing you graduate too. And speaking just for myself, I am also missing the opportunity to meet your family and friends and even to meet some of you for the first time. I arrived at GW only nine months ago to begin my tenure as Dean of the school. And like you, I was looking forward to experiencing my first C's graduation celebration in the Smith Center. Since we cannot do that this year, I sincerely hope that you will consider returning for the May 2021 commencement when we will have the opportunity to celebrate you in person. Still, we believe strongly in the value of this virtual ceremony. It allows us to honor your hard work, it marks your achievements and helps close a very important chapter in your life and point toward the opening of the next. And it gives you a moment to stop and reflect on all that you've learned over these past few years. It also reminds us of reasons for optimism as you move on. With the COVID-19 pandemic hovering over so much of what we all do these days, and with the genuine suffering and hardships that it's created for many, 
We hunger for reasons for optimism, and today we're graduating 240 of them. You are a reason for optimism. You, with your toolkit of skills and personal attributes, with your analytical and problem-solving skills, your innovative mindset, your ability to work collaboratively on projects, and your thirst for new solutions to some of society's grand challenges. Whatever your next steps, whether you are continuing on to graduate studies, starting your first professional job, entering military service or maybe the Peace Corps, or taking another path, I fully expect to find you over time working in teams and communities across the globe, developing new and better ways for humankind to live healthier and more productive lives. And as you do, I hope you'll remember to share your success stories with us so we can see together how C's graduates are shaping the future. I give you all my very best wishes and hearty congratulations. Stay well, stay strong, stay connected with C's. One of the highlights of our program is to honor some of our students who have made outstanding achievements in their course of their stay at the School of Engineering and Applied Science. I would like to ask our associate deans to announce the recipients of these awards. Hello, my name is Rumana Rifat and I'm the Associate Dean for Academic Affairs. I'm honored to be with you today to celebrate our students' achievements. We would like to recognize those candidates who are graduating with particular distinction. The first award to be presented is the Abdel Fattah Abdullah Prize. The prize recognizes scholarship and service by an upper division student. This year's recipient is Patrick Cody. Now, C's would like to recognize a graduating student who has shown a commitment to the university and the school, outstanding leadership in campus and community activities, and curricular and extracurricular accomplishments. This year's recipient of the C's Dean's Alumni Prize is Anya Welch. The Norman B. Ames Award is given to the Engineers Council to seniors who have made significant contributions to the student body, to C's, and to the university community. This year, the award goes to Kamil Dzinski, Gabriela Herrera, and Mercedes Suazo. The William and Louise Corcoran Service Award is given each year to honor those individuals, students, staff, or faculty who have done the most to support the School of Engineering and Applied Science. This year, the recipient is Raul Gabium. In recognition of his leadership of the CS Computing Facility and his commitment to supporting faculty, staff, and students in CS. The George Elowitz Memorial Award was established by Mr. and Mrs. Robert L. Morris and is awarded to the upperclassmen who demonstrated a broad interest in the humanities or social sciences. This year, the recipient is Khayati Patel. The next award was instituted in memory of Susan Shin, a student in computer science who tragically died in the fall of 2004. This award was established by her friends and classmates and is given to the student who best exemplifies caring and service to fellow C students. The Susan Shin Memorial Award goes to Myrto Kampuris. The Shelley and Steve Heller Award is presented to a female sophomore who demonstrates a commitment to studying computer science. This year, the award goes to Genevieve Flynn. The Tau Beta Pi Outstanding Sophomore Award is given to a current junior who had the highest grade point average at the end of their sophomore year. This year, the award is given to Matthew Dion and William Jackson. Hello, my name is John Corman, and I'm the Associate Dean for Research and Graduate Studies, and it's a pleasure to be with you to celebrate your success. The annual C's Research and Development Showcase was held last fall where graduate undergraduate students presented their research in a poster format and were judged by a panel of faculty and alumni on content and presentation. This year's winners were Department of Biomedical Engineering, 
Best Graduate Poster, Rose Yin. Best Undergraduate Poster, Bianca Carp Carpines. Department of Civil and Environmental Engineering. Best Graduate Poster, Mahmoud Al Hassan. Best Undergraduate Poster, Kaiti Patel and Lobna Yusuf. Department of Computer Science. Best Graduate Poster, Pedram Husseini. Best Undergraduate Poster, Denis Afanasev and Kevin Deems. Department of Electrical and Computer Engineering. Best Graduate Poster, Hao Zhang. Best Undergraduate Poster, Rachel Zaitz, Connor Kraft, and Philip Jones. Department of Engineering Management and Systems Engineering. Best Graduate Poster, Suparna Mukherjee. Best Undergraduate Poster, Justin Williams and Abigail Sharp. Department of Mechanical and Aerospace Engineering. Best Graduate po Poster, Gina Osborne. Best Undergraduate Poster, Samuel Rudy. The Neelam Prize for Social Impact was established uh, this year to recognize an upper-class student who has an interest in the application of engineering to an area of social change. This year's recipients were Caitlin Pratt and Karen Ruiz. The Martin Mahler Prize was established in 1953 as a gift from Martin Mahler. It is presented to the upper class or graduate student who submits the best reports on tests in the materials laboratory class. This year's, recipients are, this year's recipient is Yoon Sil Choi. Hello, my name is Bagi Narahari and I'm and the Associate Dean for Undergraduate Programs and I'm pleased to present the remainder of the awards. We would now like to acknowledge the winners of the annual C's Senior Design Project Awards for each major that you may note are missing from your program. For Best Biomedical Engineering Senior Design Project, the winners are For Best Senior Design Project for Civil Engineering, the winners are The Best Senior Design Project Award in Computer Science was named in honor of Arnold C. Meltzer, a former faculty and alumnus of C's. This year, the winners are The Computer Science Department also presents the Gary and Judy Bard Entrepreneurial Award to the project deemed the best with an e-commerce focus. This year, the winners are The Best Electrical Engineering Senior Design Project Award is named in memory of Daryl Rolfs, a former faculty member. This year, the winners are For Best Senior Design Project in Mechanical and Aerospace Engineering, this year's winners are For Best Senior Design Project in Systems Engineering, this year's winners are The Benjamin C. Cruikshanks Award was established in 1991 by the Engineer Alumni Association to recognize the top scholars in each of the Bachelor of Science programs. This year, the winners are For Biomedical Engineering, Shubham Gupta. For Civil Engineering, Olivia Cantrell. For Computer Engineering, Samantha Paralikas. For Mechanical Engineering, Allegra Farrar. For Systems Engineering, Mritika Contractor. The recipient of the Benjamin C. Cruikshanks Award and the Philip B. Kaplan Prize for Electrical Engineering is Caitlin Carfano. The recipient of the Benjamin C. Cruikshanks Award for Computer Science and the recipient of the Alfred Martin Frudenthal Prize given to the graduating senior with the highest grade point average in the school. This year goes to William Miller. Our final award is the Distinguished Scholar Award. 
the distinguished scholar, is this year's graduating student who best embodied academic excellence inside and outside the classroom in the spirit of the school. The 2020 C's distinguished scholar is Allegra Farrar. Congratulations to all our award winners. Graduates, this is the culmination of four years of hard work and today is a day to celebrate what you have achieved. Now you step out into the world at a time when it is changing rapidly. But we are confident that you will rise to the challenge using your own initiative and what you have learned here in SEAS. Working with others is always more rewarding and productive than working alone and even more so in these times. So nurture the community that you have built around you. Stay in touch with your friends and all of us. Congratulations, class of 2020. Raise high and seize the day. It is a tradition of the engineering school at the George Washington University that one member of the graduating class is chosen to address our celebration. Class of 2020, let me start out by saying congratulations. Today is the day to celebrate all of us and all of our accomplishments. So despite everything else in the world, don't forget that today is about you. Now, I'll state the obvious. This is not the graduation ceremony any of us expected. After years exploring DC, after countless hours spent in SEH waiting for the one of two working elevators to be going up instead of down, after all those late nights working on our capstone projects and dissertations, we're left with this, a seemingly anticlimactic end to years of hard work. And we're frustrated and angry and afraid of what the future holds. But if there's anything I've learned after four years of taking engineering exams, it's that we can't control the problem we've been given. We can only control our response. So I wanna share with all of you something that's provided me solace during all of this. And that's the significance of us graduating today as engineers. Now to me, my degree in computer engineering doesn't just mean that I've taken courses in circuitry and computer programming. It means that I, like all of us graduating today, have learned that the only response to unprecedented problems is to come up with unprecedented solutions. Our class has developed projects to improve the mobility of wheelchair users, have furthered research in computer vision software, made advancements in breast cancer research, and designed sustainable water management systems. And that is what is so important about our graduation today. It signifies our ability to recognize problems in society and work to fix them. So no matter what field you go into, no matter how uncertain the future may seem, I want you to remember how you already have experience working under pressure. You have the C's community supporting your innovation. And as of today, you have the degree that will allow you to take your ideas beyond the walls of GW. We can't control the problems we've been given, but we can come up with solutions to them. So class of 2020, I can't wait to see all the solutions we come up with. Thank you, and again, congratulations. The time has come to recognize the 2019-2020 graduating class of the George Washington University School of Engineering and Applied Science. We will now recognize the recipients of the bachelor's degrees in C's. Hello, I'm Professor Murray Lowe, Chairman of the Department of Biomedical Engineering. On behalf of our faculty and staff, it's a great pleasure to congratulate our graduates as they leave GW and go forth into the world. Professor Jason Zarr will now read the names of our Bachelor of Science in Biomedical Engineering graduates. Bachelor of Science, Biomedical Engineering. Badawi Bandar Alfrek. Amr Ahmad S. Asiri. 
Kyle William Baker. Peter E. Barrows. Sonia Beebe. Colette S. Belinsky. Daniel Burford. Anastasia K. Carr. Emily C. Chung. Christiane Chua. Nina F. Cicerelli. Rafael Colon. Camille Dushinsky. Muna A. Dowd. Kyle A. Devine. Elizabeth Mary Fisher. Makias Debebe Gebremeskel. Mateusz Stanislav Gierdelski. Daniil D. Grigoriev. Shubham Gupta. Hiroyuki N. Hutchison. Tara Sardar Jaff. Abiha Jaffrey. Dunya Karimi. Bianca C. Carpinez. Jiun Kim. Julie A. Kobira. Jacob A. Lashinsky. Amir Latifian. J. Lee. Ashley A. Lemnios. Rohan M. Manjanatha. Loren Grayson Marino. James P. McConnell. Braden Nagata. Shirali Nagam. Ebunalua Adienka Ogunwande. Robert Harold Parsons III. Kathy Chirag Patel. Nicholas J. Phillips. Kimberly Ann Pike. Karen Rius. Nicholas Alexander Robinson. Ruoshin Shen. Mercedes Suazo. Liam Sweeney. Megana Tolum. Eileen Inez Venegas. Melody A. Weigel. Zachary Eric Williams. Matthew J. Rubleski. Mona Ziai. Hello, my name is Majid Manzari. I'm the chair of the Department of Civil and Environmental Engineering. On behalf of the faculty and staff of the department, I congratulate all of our graduates today and wish each one of you the best as you move forth from GW. Professor Samer Hamdar will be reading your names as we recognize each one of you individually. Good luck. Bachelor of Science, Civil Engineering, Khalid Walid Abanumai, Joseph Anobian, Khala Tehnay Antoine, Thomas Arena, Kwame Mensah Bonsu, 
Samantha Brick Olivia Cantrell Peng Yu Chen Yun Sil Choi Catherine Sicantel Samantha Cribben Kyla Ryan Tsa Sofia Ertel Isabella Evangelista Isabella Gonzalez Gabriella Herrera Alexander Blake Jasper Isabella Johnson Giorgi Lart Fabian Gabriel Larach Joshua Okoro Grace Elizabeth Olenzak Ryan Pantalon Elizabeth Pastenk Brian Toscano Caitlin Tyson Hello, my name is Robert Pless and I am Chair of the Department of Computer Science. On behalf of the faculty and staff in our department, I would like to congratulate all of our graduating students and wish you the best of luck in your journey forward. Professors Abdu Yusuf and Susan Chang will read your names as we recognize you individually. Bachelor of Arts, Computer Science, M.D. Ahmed, Spencer Altus, Bazia Abe Baldwin, Avi B. Duhan, Zheng Yu He, David M. Huey, Abya S. Khan, Zachary Mumbauer, Andrew M. Gwen, Emily S. Riley, Glenn Thomas Warren, Jr. Bachelor of Science, Computer Science, Dennis Afanasiv, David E. Alejos, Jack Ashford, Eamon Bajwa, Jaysok Choi, Patrick J. Cody, Zachary Day, Alison DeChico, Larissa Jufak Basso, Joseph Aspie, Benjamin P. Fernandez Jr., Jenny Fisher, Sogan Gods, Matthew T. Gilmore, Joseph John Halal, Chloe Hutchins, Henry J. Jench, Shen K. G., Monica V. Kabathikar, Rachel Soyun Kim, Xiaoyang Liang, Wyming Long, Timothy Litkin, Mihir R. Mankat, Daniel E. Marley, Braden Paul Meyerhofer, Paul Miller, Theodore Marcus Miller, William R. Miller, Jonathan R. Minkin, Alicia Don Montgomery, Shiva Umrani Sabagi, Simon Aswin Patel, Gregor G. Peach, Robert Thomas Rankin, Kyle E. Root, Suraj S. Shah, Leon Nicole Shawl, Abigail Shriver, Eric A. Wendt, Jennifer A. Wright, Ahmed K. Yilmaz, Jiawe Zhang, Yang K. Zhao. Hello, I'm Suresh Subramanian, the Chair of the Department of Electrical and Computer Engineering. On behalf of the faculty and staff of the department, I'd like to congratulate all of our graduates and wish each of you the best as you go forth from GW. Professor Peman Degadian will be reading your names as we recognize you individually. Bachelor of Science, Computer Engineering, Nolan Carvalho, Reem El Tahir, William Haftel, Michael Hegarty, Yarema Ayosipif, Gregory Franklin Cole, Paul Kennedy, Connor Kraft, Sofia Victoria Martinez, Kirti Narayanan, Samantha Paralikas, 
Rachel Sabrina Zoltz, Bachelor of Science, Electrical Engineering. Khaled Alul, Caitlin Carfano, Richard Adam Dedu, Mary DePaul, Joseph Frangillo, Marshall Hijazi, Devin Ann Jezup, Philip Jones, Brandon Christopher McGee, Christine Melling, David Nguyen, Tian Nguyen, Jonathan Entail, Young Song Park, Holy Zimmerman. Hello, my name is Tom Mazuki and I'm the Chairman of the Department of Engineering Management and Systems Engineering. On behalf of the faculty and staff of the department, I would like to congratulate each and every graduate this year and thank them for the hard work that they've done. We wish you the very, very best going forward from GW. And we're sorry we can't take your pictures with you today, but if you come back, we'll take pictures with you as an alumni. Now I will have Professor Van Dorp read each name as we recognize our graduates individually. Bachelor of Arts, Applied Science and Technology, George Fragulias, Manyung Emma Han, Jesse A. Rabaglia, Bachelor of Science, Systems Engineering, Jose M. Barba, Gabriela Barber, Mritika Contractor Matthew E. Cody Joseph C. Danks Gabriel Adrian Figueroa Arce Joshua A. Finn Grant Khan Jamichi Gabriela Verastegui Luna Victoria M. Nielsen, Elisa Catherine Nittinger, David Elias Ojeda, Shreya Patel, Aditya Singh, Joshua Smith, Maria Valeria Soto, Sophie Steinberg, Finley H. Wetmore, Justin C. Williams, Alec Edward Jerkovic. Hello, my name is Michael Plesniak and I am the Chair of the Department of Mechanical and Aerospace Engineering. On behalf of the faculty and staff of the department, I would like to congratulate all of our graduates today and wish you each the best as you go forth from GW. We are delighted to honor your accomplishments and we are very proud of each and every one of you. I look forward to hearing of your achievements as mechanical and aerospace engineers or in other pursuits as your careers progress. Best wishes for success in all of your future endeavors. Professor Charles Garris will be reading your names as we recognize you individually. Bachelor of Science in Mechanical Engineering, Isaac S. Abacasas, Kadiha Abu Salama, Jihoon An, Joel Asiyama, Jungmin Bai, Noor Bahash, John Bassett, Rachel Gabriel Bittner, Stephen Joseph Brunetto Jr. John Chambers, Daniela Coaquira Uros, Justin T. Connor, Derek R. Dickahuth, Dellen B. Etzel, Allegra Dane Farrar, 
Isaac G. Finberg, Aaron E. Flynn, Maximilian Forstenheilsler, Cameron Delaney Foster, Kylie Madison Gleason, Emma Glaistein, Rachel Gray, Robert Norman Griffith III, Ellis R. Goosewich, Alexis B. Hare, Benjamin Thomas Harris, Britt Andrew Kaukinen, Problein Kaur, Jared Joseph Kern, Idan E. King, Oliver G. Lochar, Sebastian Laura, Michael T. Makarialu, Eliana S. Mahahani, Tiran Manchanda, Jordan P. Markovsky, Marshall Richards McCraw, Angus Ross McLaren, Timothy Moore, Alexandra L. Morganti, Danielle Nguyen, Marisa L. Olivo, Gabriel Carmen Parkel, Dominic Joseph Petrosino, Jr., Nathan R. Pollock, Samantha N. Raccoon, Isabel F. Broth, Samuel L. Rudy, Mitchell Santos, Jonathan B. Swartz, Andrea Sperry, Nahiv Talukter, Fariz Teller, Alexander T. Weitzel, Connor M. West, Brandon N. Wu, Sishan Su. Class of 2020, as you go forth from GW on Sunday, do so with optimism for the future. Share your talents and gifts with your colleagues, communities, families, and friends to make our already good but ever-changing world an even better place. Continue to thirst for knowledge and seek solutions to society's grand challenges. And stay in touch with us. Let us know how you are and stop by when you are in DC. Meet in person or virtually with the students coming after you at SEAS and inspire them with your story. All of us benefit professionally and personally from a strong, caring, involved SEAS alumni network. Good luck to you all. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of the School of Engineering and Applied Science, I thank you all for joining us to celebrate the achievements of our 2020 graduates. Congratulations, graduates. I wish you all the best. Class of 2020, congratulations and good luck. And since we can't send you off in person, please come and visit us as soon as possible. Raise high, GW. We can't let this moment pass without congratulating the class of 2020. Even though we're going through this pandemic, we can't overlook all the hard work you did to get here. So congratulations to you. Congrats, C's class of 2020. Congratulations, graduates of 2020, and good luck in all of your future endeavors. Congratulations, class of 2020. You guys did it. Hello, graduating seniors. I'm so happy to know that you've done your due diligence and made it through this trying time. 
and I hope everything happens with you uh, as you wish and happy graduation. Thank you for your contributions to GW and we wish you well. Yay! Hello class 2020. I'd like to thank each and every one of you for your help, support, and for helping shape the identity of the computing facility at the George Washington University. Congratulations. Hello class, 2020 is your special day. Congrats, you made it. I wish you all a lot of luck in the future. Dear engineering class of 2020, congratulations on your accomplishment and welcome to the C's alumni family. That's right in. Congratulations, class of 2020. This is Professor Murray Snyder, and I would like to congratulate the seniors for completing four rigorous years in the School of Engineering and Applied Science. And I think I contributed to the rigor in thermodynamics, fluid mechanics, and aircraft performance. And as always, uh, don't forget your unit analysis. And for the Baja and uh, Rocket teams, it was a real pleasure to be your faculty advisor. And uh, you guys did exceedingly well, and I am very proud of you. Congratulations, C's class of 2020. Great job. To the C's class of 2020, congratulations. We are so proud of you. To the MAE students in particular, it has been an honor and a privilege to watch you grow as engineers and professionals during your time here at C's. I wanna give a very special congratulations to the members of my research group who are graduating, Michael Oral, Rachel Gray, Ryan Welch, Panos Ramos, and Ben Gisusisik, congratulations. I'm so proud of you. Congratulations to all our graduates of class 2020. We are very proud of your success, and we wish you all the best in the next stage of your life. Yeah, go ahead. Well done. I'm so excited for you all. Congratulations. congratulations. Hi, class of 2020. We're so sorry we're not here to celebrate with you in person, but we're so proud of you and we can't wait to see what you have to offer. Hopefully we'll all be together next year to celebrate in person. Have a great summer and hopefully we'll see y'all soon. Congratulations, all the best for your future career. Congratulations, class of 2020. I'm very sorry I cannot tell you in person, but I send you my very best wishes. Congratulations, great job. I wish you the best. I'd like to extend my best wishes to the graduating class of 2020. Um, I know it's tough to have uh, your last semester on coronavirus lockdown, but perhaps that will give you uh, lots of good stories for the rest of your lives. Um, so best of luck in the future. I hope you have great success in your careers, and I hope we see each other again in the future. Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs> Go, Jake. Congratulations, class of 2020. Wanted to give my heartfelt congratulations to the uh, C's graduates of the year 2020. You should be really proud of your accomplishments. I'm very sorry that we're not having a regular ceremony and we're able to do this in person. Please do stay in touch. Uh, professors always love to hear from their students in the future. Lots of success and hope to see you again soon. Take care. One, two. Three. Three. Congratulations! Hi, I'm Royce Francis from EMSC, and it's my pleasure to congratulate you on completing this journey. I am so proud of you guys for showing the resilience, the inner strength, the creativity, and the perseverance that you needed over these past couple of months and that will serve you well as you pursue your careers um, and in your future lives with your families and your communities. God bless and congratulations. Congratulations everybody on your great achievement, especially to our students at the EC department. We are all proud of you. Please stay connected. We are looking forward to see you again. Dear students, congratulations. I am very happy of your success. I wish you the very best for your future and uh, don't forget us, keep in touch. Dear class of 2020, congratulations. Wherever your path may take you, 
I wish all of you a very successful future full of happiness and joy. Stay in touch and pursue your dreams. Congratulations to the GW class of 2020. You guys have shown a lot of resilience and I wanna congratulate you and wish you good luck in all your future endeavors. Hello, class of 2020. I am Pablo Frank Bolton, a professor from the computer science department. This is my wife, Mariana. Hello. We just wanted to congratulate you on an amazing accomplishment. And uh, you should be really proud of what you achieved, especially considering this uh, last hardship uh, from this uh, semester. So go, you should, you should be extremely proud. And we just wanted to congratulate you. So congratulate you. So uh, good luck. Right. Bye. Hi. This is Professor Heller wishing you a virtual congratulations on your graduation to all of my adv advisees. I know this isn't my office and this isn't my office hours, but I really am excited to extend to you a congratulations on all the things that you have done to get to this day. Wasn't the day you were expecting, but it is still the best day going forward. And for those of you who are still missing a document or two, I'm available online to process those forms. Go C's, go grads, go succeed. Congratulations, class of 2020. You made it. Now it's time to celebrate. I hope uh, you will be here next year so we can celebrate in person. In the meantime, take care, go change the world. Congratulations, class of 2020. Wishing you success and happiness going forward. Dear graduates, congratulations on your achievements. These are special times. I'm confident that with the knowledge and skills you have acquired at GW, you will make the world a safer and healthier place. Good luck to you on all your endeavors, and please stay in touch. You have made an incredible journey to come this far. This is your moment, this is your day. So seize the day and seize the world. Congratulations, so proud of you all. This is Professor Radis congratulating the class of 2020. I've been very lucky to have many of you in three or even four classes. You have been great students and I know you will do very well in the future. Congratulations on successfully completing a very rigorous curriculum. Congratulations. Wish you all the best. Hi, class 2020. Uh, I just want to say congratulations on the great work you've done, um, especially during this unprecedented time. And I wish you the best in your future endeavors. Class of 2020, you guys have made it. I wish I could shake hands with you one by one in person. It is indeed challenging times, but please remember, when the tides are high, the wind is strong too. So congratulations and rise high. Congratulations, C's class of 2020. You made it, despite all the challenges. So keep calm, you are an engineer now. As you embark on a new journey, I wish you the best of luck and keep in touch. Dear BME graduates, Congratulations on your big achievement. What a time to finish college and enter your life. Life is beautiful and despite all the challenges, I'm sure you will get to do great things, reach out for your dreams and make us all proud. May the force be with you. Hello, Professor K here. Congratulations to the BME graduates and to all of the 2020 graduates of the School of Engineering and Applied Science. Congratulations and all the best from Professor Wesner Derich from Biomedical Engineering Department and two future GW students. My name is Gila and I'm nine years old. And My name is Posita and I'm seven years old. Good luck with everything. Class of 2020, first of all, congratulations. I know this is different than we hoped, but you can't let that diminish your pride in your accomplishments at GW. I know you're gonna go out through the world and do great things, and I can't wait to see it happen. Congratulations and stay in touch. 
Congratulations, Class of 2020, from a very deserted dean's office. We hope to see you next year for GW's Bicentennial. Hello, Class of 2020. We miss you. Congratulations. Job well done. Go Seas. Congratulations. Class of 2020. From the Seas. Advising. Team. Woo! To the graduates of the class of 2020, congratulations from the Office of Graduate Admissions and Student Services and SEAS Careers. It was a pleasure working with you during your time here at the School of Engineering and Applied Science. We wish you the best of luck in your future endeavors and always remember to raise high. Congratulations, class of 2020. You did it. The world is ready for you.